5 Facts You Didn't Know About Kill Bill Sword, Hattori Hanzo Number 1, the sword is named after the legendary samurai and master swordsmith Hattori Hanzo, who is a fictional character in the movies. According to the movie storyline, Hattori Hanzo had sworn off making swords after a life filled with violence. However, he eventually agrees to craft a sword for the protagonist, Beatrix Kiddo, played by Uma Thurman, to help her on her quest for revenge. Hattori Hanzo is portrayed as an exceptional swordsmith, renowned for his craftsmanship and expertise in creating traditional Japanese swords. Real-life swordsmith inspiration, the character of Hattori Hanzo in the movie is inspired by an actual historical figure. Hattori Hanzo was a famous samurai and ninja during Japan's Sengoku period in the 16th century. However, the depiction of the swordsmith Hattori Hanzo in the film is fictional. Number 2, Signature Inscription, the katana in Kill Bill features an inscription on the blade. It reads, To my brother Bud, the only man I ever loved, Bill. This inscription adds a personal touch to the sword, emphasizing its significance in the film's narrative and the relationship between the characters. It symbolizes honor, skill, and the quest for justice. It serves as a tangible link to the samurai tradition and represents the bride's determination to seek revenge and confront her enemies head-on. Number 3. Approximately 60,000 US dollars of the movie's budget was used for producing swords and sword accessories, total kills of the sword are more than 50 plus. Despite being made for killing the death list 5, the sword is only used to kill one of them, Oren Ishii and also most of her subordinates, and had not a big role in the killing of the four remaining members. Number 4. They really sliced a baseball in half. During the scene where the bride gets the sword from her toy Hanzo, he throws a baseball at her, which she cuts in two. They didn't fake it, though it was Thurman's stunt double, Zoe Bell, who actually did it. Number 5. The Curse. As stated by Quentin Tarantino on the TCM special interview, Elvis Mitchell, under the influence, in the Kill Bill universe. Once a Hanzo sword is unsheathed, it must get some blood spilled on it or a curse is placed on the current owner of the sword.